And that's a problem because there are these huge holes in my understanding of magic because I read things at different times and in isolation and kind of didn't get the context. So right now what I'm doing is I'm reading through all of the jinx and then I'm going to read a little bit of the Sphinx and I'm going to read all the Phoenix because you got those opening bits. I mean, the tricks are great, but also the opening bits where he talks about your animus like, oh, that Hilliard guy, he's great. And then the next day, like, he died. My friend is dead. I'm so sad. Dad, what's going to happen to greater magic? But also reading through it, I'm so much more quickly getting a sense of like all this other stuff I've read. I'm able to put it in the timeline and go, oh, oh, okay. This makes sense because we've been reading our Art of Magic. We've been yep. waiting for Hilliard to produce this new thing. And now he's dead. And we're like, what's going to, okay, I get it. And I get where Art of Magic fits into that. And I get where greater magic fits into that.